Hello and welcome back everyone to the Bones of Ragnwald. We are very very close, maybe not very very close, but maybe only very close, to finishing the current Let's Play because as I said, this is just meant for testing. We finished the main storyline in the last episode and now the only thing to take a look at now is uh, at the features that you get when you start your, your own empire. And I think <clears throat> in the last episode I already thought I could start here, because at least that castle is somewhat close to my friends. Or maybe I could start in Lomraid. Nevertheless, I'm not ready yet, guys. I only have 122 people and that is probably not enough, especially because some of them are recruits. So what I will do now, I will take like, I don't know, maybe one, two, three in-game weeks and recruit people, upgrade them, run around, gather renown, gather right to rule, maybe get some more companions and build an army. And as soon as I have an army, I will start attacking one thief. I'm not so sure yet, as I said, probably that castle or maybe that town. Not so sure yet. So I'm not going to show all of that because that is going to be just running around and building an army. That could take a very long time. Okay. If anything interesting is going to happen in the meantime, obviously I'm going to show that, but right now I will just build an army. So we'll see each other when I have an army or when something interesting is going to happen. And I think we are ready, guys. Okay, it is now May the 23rd. I have no idea how long that... How long it took now to get here, but I think I could be ready to attack something. Let me see. We have some people in our army. I just took all the prisoner prisoners I got, so who cares? At least my army is full. I do have some nice people with me, so that should be enough to start my empire. And when I when I traveled back to Blackmire, I saw that Fort Wolfesley only had like 60 people in the garrison. Yeah, can you see that? Only 65 people. Let me take a look. Yeah, this is a siege, that is a siege tower. That is a problem because a siege tower takes like... Who, who has the highest en engineer skill? Okay, Elia has an engineer of 6, but still a siege tower takes like, I don't know, 50 hours maybe. And I don't want to wait that long because those guys usually catch me while I'm busy building the siege tower and then I have to fight them. And... I will just get rid of that guy very quickly now and then it's time to attack something. Not that castle because it's a siege tower but something. And well since that guy obviously doesn't want to attack me I have to do it. Okay my god they have a lot of archers can you see that? They're only like how many like 40 people but they have like a thousand archers. Okay let me see. Now everyone just charge in, we should be fine. What about the battle size? Still 100 and no, 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 150 is fine. Everyone charge in, come on. Those are the last guys before getting my own empire, I guess. Okay, come on. Please do not die now because I need every single one of you. Stop spawning skeletons. I need every single one of you in the upcoming fights, guys. Please do not die. Oh, seems like we hit the border of the map. Uh, anymore? Yeah, I still see some of these gothy stones flying around. Uh, where are those those guys? Yeah, here. Stop that! I said stop that. Ouch! Anyone else? No, my gladiator died. Anyone else? Go away. I think we're fine. I just want to start my empire. Go, go out of my way, guys. Maybe I should have recruited some of these Ernar units because my God, they are strong. Okay, whatever. It is time to click on done and to gather the remaining items and take a look at that castle maybe. Uh, let me see, 91, that's like a hundred people. That should be fine, right? Um, prepare ladders, I think that's, that's good. Yeah, I like ladders. I hate siege towers, but I, I like ladders. Okay, come on, come on. And here we go. And I know that if the ladders become ready during the night, the game will wait for it to become daytime again, even though the ladders are ready. Okay. Just a just a small information. Wait, I see gothy. Oh no, I see freaking gothy stones. 
Yeah, no problem. I don't really think these ancestors will be a, will be a huge problem. Ouch! But could you could you please not shoot me? Yeah, this is exactly why, what I want to see. Can you see that all these sharpshooters? But the problem is we're just killing those those ancestors right now. Oh, and it seems like they they are going back to the to the castles. Yeah, I know because because defenders in sieges usually don't charge. But I think it would make sense to let the ancestors charge if that's possible. Because I'm not so sure if it makes that much sense that these gothies throw their stones at us and then the, the ancestors just travel back to the, uh, to the castle. Yeah, it seems like we're doing a good job, but we're just killing these freaking ancestors. Like, are we actually killing some, some real people here? I'm not so sure. Should I charge in? I'm not so sure. You know what? The the sharpshooters can stay right here. The infantry and the cavalry can just charge in. I guess we'll be fine. Hopefully. I still. Oh, maybe maybe I should just kill those guys. Why am I not, why am I not doing that? Yeah. Maybe I should have done that right from the beginning. Okay. Anyone else? Any more gothies? Yes, right here. Uh, I missed. And, ooh, I hit, and come on. Yes, very good, another one gone. Maybe I should try to get some of these gothy stones for myself, just like I did back in Norden Fjordor in the dungeon. Headshot and still alive, that is, that is so embarrassing. Uh, you know what, just everyone charge, because I think it doesn't really make much sense to just let uh, the infantry and the cavalry charge in, because like I have like a thousand... Uh, arches with me. Hello there! Are you ready to die? Goodbye, ancestor. <laughs> a thousand ancestors. Okay. Hello, A Will Knights. I know you want to kill people, and now it is your chance to do so. Aginum Sergeant, do it. Looking like a coon, guys. Hello there, people! How are you doing? Hopefully, you're doing fine, because now I'm here to kill you. The only problem is that Erna guys are freaking strong. Like I hit him, I hit him three times and he's still alive. Okay, my own empire, it is within reach. And then I'm going to take a look at everything I can do with my own empire here. Wait, we're winning that, right? I'm, I'm, I'm not so sure anymore if we, we, if we can actually win that. Because, oh yeah, the, the uh, crossbowman, oh yeah. Now I know what, what's happening. Oh god, they are still throwing their stones. <laughs> oh shit. Okay, hopefully no one is shooting at me because I need time to kill you. Yeah, I should take care of these of these priests like very, very early. Because now they spawn like a thousand ancestors. Gothy stones. Can I pick those things up? Yes, I can. Okay, take that, Ernar. Now I'm going to spawn my own little my own little army. Yeah, I'm probably going to die in just a second. Wait, what kind of banner do those guys have? Uh, the the ancestors. I think they spawn with the banner from the enemy and not with my banner. Okay, who the heck cares? Uh, this is not why I'm here. I'm here to start my empire. Wait, are we are we are we losing that? <laughs> oh god. Can I pick up some more gothy stones? I think they despawned. Okay, come on, Marie Dachois. Kill some people here. Like that. I, I should probably just shoot... No more arrows, never mind. I just wanted to say I should probably just shoot in that direction. I'll be fine. And I dropped my sword, and I think my sword is gone. Hunter bow. Arrows. Oh, 12 new arrows. Very nice. I don't really care too much if all of my people are going to die now, because I'm not really going to to attack anything else, I guess. This is probably the last episode, I'm not so sure. Just wanna take a look at what you can do with your own empire now. God, those Erna guys are freaking strong. I just need a one-handed weapon and I could help you guys. Is there a one-handed weapon around here somewhere? C can, I, can I pick up that axe? Oh, that's probably a throwing weapon. Bones, round shields. Got so many arrows stuck in the wall. <laughs> um. Okay, where are the remaining enemies? Right here, for example. Boom, and one more time, and... 
God, he's still alive. Yeah, my bow's not really that good yet. But 500 experience for a single of those archer guys. Just need a one-handed weapon. Let me run around with a freaking bow now. The good thing is, if the skeletons need a weapon, they can just they can just cut off their own limbs and then they have a bone and can fight with that thing. <laughs> okay, let me take a look. Uh, we lost 37 people. 300! Just take a look. I think it's sad that they have like... A hundred? I cannot really remember it, but I think it's sad that they had they, that they have a hundred people. So they spawned like two hundred ancestors. <laughs> okay, now I know for the future. If the game gets released, and if you want my advice, guys, kill kill the gothies first, because my god. Okay, I think we did it. I'm not really going to recruit anyone here. Okay. That should be it, my lady. We've taken uh, Marth Castle. Do you wish to? Who do we wish to give it to? Now a centurion is talking to me because all of my companions are dead. I want to have it for myself. Uh, plunder it and keep it for yourself. Plunder it and share it equally between your vessels and yourself. Now I'm not going to plunder it. Okay, I don't really care. Just that guy, Marida Twas Kingdom. Yeah, if you know me, you already know the names of my. Of my uh, elegance, of my empire. It doesn't really matter, but who cares? Okay, a leaf. I want to change the domestic policy. Well, I still know that from the from the Perisno, uh, from the Perisno mod. But I'm not going to change anything right here. That's that's not what, what what's important right now. Okay, here we are. Uh, go to the Lord's Hall. Can can I do something here now? Oh, let me see. We have ladies. That's probably just a, a lady from, uh, you know, from from the Erna Empire. Hello, Asitbor. If I may offer you a world, shouldn't that say word and not world? If I offer you a word of advice, it seems yeah, your your right to rule is bad. I know. Another party prisoner joining, spied on another kingdom. Strengthen, rejoin. I want you to grant. I want to hire a new staff member, an alchemist. This is what I want to take a look at. So, be it. I don't really care how much money that guy wants. Um, new staff member, a constable. That is probably the guy who takes care of all war-related stuff. And I want to appoint a chamberlain to handle financial affairs. I think we. I think we're good. Okay, I think I have everything now. Okay, let's go back to the Lord's Hall. Maybe there's something else I could do with a town, but I'm not so sure if I'm strong enough to attack a town now because I lost quite a few people here. Okay, Jambolane, uh, the alchemist, and a constable. How goes the war? Information about the settlement. Look to hire a household guardsman. Uh, I think I don't have any more money, right? Uh, a group of 10 will cost you 10,000 silver from the treasury. Talk to the Chamberlain to deposit into the treasury. Okay, I need to do that. I'd like to take a look at the armory. Okay, no, that's not what I need. Let's talk about recruits and training. Talk about patrols. Dismissed from my service. Thank you. Come back later. Okay, nothing nothing too interesting. I saw all of that in Parisno already, I guess. Uh, the Chamberlain. No, 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 let us inspect the treasury. The current zero silvers I would like to pay into the treasury. 10,000. And another 10,000. And now let me take a look at the household guards. Nothing, just wanted to check the documents. Household guardsmen, I shall hire them. Let me see, are those the household guards from Parisno? They probably are. Let me take a look. Talk. Let me see your equipment. Tell me about yourself. No, those are not the household gods from Perisno, I think. Because in Perisno you could equip them however you want. Maybe I could do that in the in the in the menu. What happens if I give him that? Probably nothing, right? Yeah, they're not going to equip that. Okay, never mind. Um let's go back. We still have a lot to we have still we still have a lot to check out. The Alchemist, for example. Hello. Chamberlain. Financial affairs check like thief improvements like to manage the household and secondary storage. I don't really need that I think. No, that's not what I need. No, you are dismissed. Okay. 
So now comes the interesting part. Hello, Alchemist. Hello, Your Highness. I am not researching anything at the moment. I want you to begin research. I want you to establish your own laboratory in this place. Yeah, maybe I should do that first. Excellent. That would greatly help my experimental and estimated cost of ten, uh, no, a thousand silvers from the treasury. You will need a chamberlain for uh, in order to deposit into the treasury. I am sure. Excellent. I will move my operations here. Okay, I will go back. Can I see it? No. There it is. Visit the visit the alchemy lab. Oh, freaking hell! Okay, let me take a look. Just want to take a look around before I talk to that guy. So you're an alchemist and you're a blacksmith at the same time, I guess. Anything I could I, I could touch here? Hello, alchemist. I'm going to talk to you in a second, but let me just quickly take a look around. Okay, that door is probably locked. Yes, it is. Let's take a look at Mr. Alchemy. Hello there. What can I do with you? Hello, your highness. I'm not researching anything. I want you to close it. You're dismissed. Okay, I want you to begin research. What would you like me to investigate for you? The money will come from the treasury, so make sure to talk to your chamberlain if you don't have sufficient funds. Armor, weapons... Horses make a potion to increase my skills. Well, I guess I, I want a new weapon. Very well. What type of weapon shall I be looking into? Um, what about a kite shield, a pole axe? What about a crossbow? Very good. It will cost 1,200 to research that. Do you have the money in the treasury? Yes, I do. I will start. It will take seven days to complete that. Okay. While he's researching stuff, I will... Only 36 people alive. Um, well, I have to pre prevent people from attacking that. So I will place a few people in the garrison, like maybe 40 people, something like that. I still have enough people. So I will place some people in the garrison, then go back to the towns, hire some mercenaries, kill some bandits to get some more money, and then I will wait one in-game week for that guy to be done. Uh, manage the garrison. Just just place a few units in there so that they don't. Why can I not give that? Wait, why can I not give household guardsmen to the to the garrison? Okay, maybe because they're supposed to protect me, I guess, as their queen. Okay, the scrappers can go. The rogue knights can go. No, I want to have the knights. The horsemen can go. The rangers, the sergeants. That could be f enough already, I guess. Click, click, yeah, that should be enough. Okay, that should prevent at least some lords from attacking. Okay, one in-game week, that means May the 31st. So let me run around a bit and wait for that guy to be to be done. Days left for Alchemist to complete his research zero. But I think it will take one more day, I'm not so sure. None of, the, none of those guys is attacking me, I think. They're just traveling to raid my villages and I don't really care about that. Okay, let me see. Are you, are you ready? I think it I think he needs one more day. Even though it's at zero, I think he needs one more day, right? I uh, want you to cancel it, want you to close it, you're dismissed. It's not finished yet, yeah, that's what I thought. He needs one more day. So let's just wait here. For the time being I can prevent attacks on Marth Castle because I increased the garrison and it's fine. I can just keep them away. Killing people from time to time and patrolling, just run away. I don't really care about you. Okay, but I think soon we will be fine. Uh, let me see. Evening, midnight. No, no, no. Yeah, I do lose quite a lot of money and I won't be having any more money in the next month. But I don't think that I will need another uh, budget report. Because if I need another budget report, I'm going to be in trouble. But I think that's it. Following Marida Twaya. If you want to follow me, then do that. I think, I think we'll be fine. Uh, we, I think we should be done. Uh, go to the laboratory. Let me take a look. Hello, alchemist. Uh, my research is not finished yet. Well, you have to, you have to hurry. <laughs> because I'm not sure. Oh, has completed his research. Uh, laboratory, come on. Ooh, there he is. Hello, your highness. My research is complete. Uh, I want you to close it. You're dismissed. I want to finish. I want your finished re finished research. Arbalest. Here's my first version of it. Talk to your constable if you want to equip troops with it. 
What? I, but I got an item like that for myself. 59. Is that better than the sniper, the sniper crossbow? Um, I think I gave that sniping thing to to Skjolds. Let me see your equipment. Let me just quickly compare that. Um, the arbalest is a little bit faster, but the sniper crossbow is a bit better. Yeah, I mean. He just said it. This is just the first version, but I can e I can equip troops with that. Uh, go to the Lord's Hall. Let me take a look. Hello, Mister uh, Constable. I guess information upgrade my household guardsman. Very well. Here's their equipment. You can equip anything that your alchemist has crafted for you. Oh, now I see. I will take care of making all the equipment for them. Uh, let me see. Arbalest, wait, what? Okay, wait a second. I guess okay, that is the current equipment, I guess, from my from my household gods, right? So I guess they have the, the arbalest already. I guess. Excellent, they will now use that equipment. Wait a second. Uh, I think I put them no, they they are still with me. Household guardsman. Let me take and uh, let me see your equipment. No, they do not have the arbalest yet. I think the left screen is the screen my, my inventory, so to speak, and the right screen is probably the equipment of the household guys. Let me take a look. Uh, um, that is their equipment, right? Wait, do. Wait, are they lacking the strength? No, I don't think that. Um, wait a second. I gotta figure that out. Give me a second here. Give me a report. I'd like to take a look at the armory. I don't know. Let's put that thing in the armory. Whatever that is going to do for me. Talk about recruits in general and dismiss from my service. Wait a second. Financial tax rate improvements. No, I do not need you. Strangle on MSU, Marshall rejoin, vessel staff member, no new staff members. Okay, I really need the constable here. But what about what about those guys? They still tell me about yourself. They have enough strength. Oh, now they have that thing. Yes, now they have two of... Oh, I think I just needed to change something in the left screen so that it gets updated maybe. Okay, so the left screen is the equipment of my household guards, but I just need to to change something in the equipment screen, I guess, so that it updates, I guess. <laughs> I'm still not so sure, <laughs> but at least I have it now. Okay, should I research some more? Yeah, you know what, let's start another research, but I'm just going to kill these, these Ernan uh, guys around me to get some more money. Uh, maybe maybe I'm going to research research something else. Hello, Your Highness. I'm not researching anything. Begin a research. Potion increased my skill. It costs five thousand. Yeah, I don't have the money. Uh, do I have prisoners? No, I don't. Okay, uh, I guess I will just uh, kill that guy really quickly and capture some of those guys and sell them. I guess at the ransom broker. Yep, I need some money. Uh, give me give me a few days and I'm going to get some more money and start another research. And you know what, I was actually kind of surprised that I don't have enough money, but now I realized I need to, to put the money into the treasury, I forgot about that. Uh, wait a second. You're the guy I need for my treasury, right? I don't know, army retraining, troop movement... No, wait a second. Oh, I need the chamberlain, never mind. Inspect the treasury, would like to pay into the treasury, because I do have some money. Okay, now I have 40,000, that should be enough. Alchemist laboratory. Uh, begin research a potion. Yes, do it. It will take 10 days this time. Hmm. You know what? I'm going to make a companion lord. Uh, how many How many uh, villages do I have? Only a single village. Yeah, I'm going to make one of my companions a lord and tell him to follow me all the time to make it easier for me to defend me against any incoming Urna uh, lords. Okay, it is time to wait for 10 more days because I want to see that potion. Your alchemist has completed his research. Here we go. It took like 10 days, obviously. And I made Aelia a lord. And she's running around and helping me here a little bit. Luckily enough. Okay, what do we have? We have Mr. Alchemy Guy. Come on, give me my potion. 
Your hello, your highness. My research is complete. I want your finished research. All your weapon proficiencies have increased by plus 20. Here's the potion. Drink up. Uh, will cost 5,000. Do you have the money? Okay. I don't think I'm going to... Uh, do anything else with that guy because it actually takes quite a long time and I already spent like over over One and a half hours for that episode. Okay be begin research. I don't know breed of horses. Yeah breed a horse It costs three thousand well when take 21 days. Well, I'm pretty sure that's going to be a good horse But I'm not going to wait for that that shall be it because as far as I'm aware the game will get released very very soon anyway So I'm not going to test anything else to be honest. I didn't encounter any major bugs I'm not so sure if I even saw a single one maybe some minor things, but that game is ready to get released I guess Well, the main storyline is obviously not over There is more to see and I cannot wait to go to Jokulsfell and actually see the catacombs there so there's there's still some there are still some things that you can explore when the game gets greased. But as I said, this shall be it. That is it for the testing. Bones of Rangvold, the test version for you. I'm going to end it here, and I guess we're going to see each other again in a few weeks, a few months, when the game is finally out, and then I think I will start a full playthrough. But my god, that map is freaking huge. Conquering everything will take an eternity. <laughs> Well, I haven't even checked out that location right here. I've never been here. Maybe there's something hidden there. Yeah, obviously, I didn't see anything. Oh, I, no, I didn't see that. That was not correct. I didn't see everything. That was... I wanted to say that. Because there are some more chests hidden. There is a lot to see. But, you know, I'm not going to talk for an eternity now. As I said, let's end it here. That's it for Bones of Rangwald. We'll see each other again when the game gets fully released. Thank you very much, dear developers, for giving me that test version. And I'm eager to see the main storyline when it's completed. We're going to see each other again in a few months. You know the deal, okay? Until then, everyone, farewell.